Pretoria versus Accra. Which city is better? Accra, Ghana's capital, covers an area of 225.67 km square and has a population of 4.2 million people as of 2020. It is divided into 12 local government districts, 11 municipal districts and the Accra Metropolitan District, which is the capital's only district with city status. The term Accra normally refers to the Accra Metropolitan Area, which serves as Ghana's capital, with the city of Accra distinguishing the district under the jurisdiction of the Accra Metropolitan Assembly from the remainder of the city. However, in everyday speech, the phrases Accra and city of Accra are interchangeable. Pretoria, on the other hand, is the administrative capital of the Republic of South Africa and is located in the Gauteng region. Pretoria spreads along both sides of the Apais River and into the Magalisberg's western foothills on the east. Marfinus, the son of Andres Pretorius, the Boer statesman for whom the city is named, founded the city in 1855. It became the capital of the Transvaal in 1860, the administrative capital of South Africa in 1910, and a city in 1931. Winston Churchill was imprisoned in South Africa during the South African War until his escape in 1899. On May 31, 1902, the Peace of Very Nijing was signed at Melrose House, bringing the conflict to a conclusion. Join us on Africa Reloaded today as we compare Pretoria with Accra to see which city is the better. As you travel through these cities, stay connected. Demographic Factor Pretoria Pretoria is situated between the Bushveld and the Highveld, north of Johannesburg. It covers a total distance of 1,644 kilometers. The city has a population of over 700,000 people, and the metropolitan area has a population of over 2 million people. According to 2011 data, the majority ethnicity was white, accounting for 52.5% of the population. Black Africans made up 42% of the population, with colored accounting for 2.5%, Indian or Asian for 1.9%, and other accounting for 1.2%. This is a dramatic shift from 2001 data, which showed whites accounting for 67.7% of the population and black Africans only 24.5%. When township populations are taken into account, whites in Pretoria become a minority, despite the city still having the greatest white population in sub-Sahara Africa. Accra The huge proportion of younger citizens is one of the most noteworthy aspects of Accra's demography. 66% of the population is under the age of 24. In the following years, this pattern is unlikely to change. The city has a somewhat greater male population than female population, which is consistent with national statistics. According to statistics, around 45% of Accra's people are immigrants who came from other African nations. Migration rates, on the other hand, are likely to decline in the future. Accra has a number of low-income housing neighborhoods, with approximately 58% of the population living in one of them. Geography Pretoria Pretoria, located 50 kilometers north of Johannesburg in South Africa's northeast, is a transitional area between the Highveld and the Bushveld. It is located 1,370 meters above sea level, in a warm, well-sheltered, agricultural valley bordered by the Magalisberg Ranges Hills. Accra On the Gulf of Guinea, Accra is Ghana's capital and largest city. The settlement is built partly on a cliff that rises 25 to 40 feet above the undulating Accra Plains and expands northward. Occasional earthquakes are caused by the area's sensitivity to faulting. Infrastructure Pretoria South Africa's national economic infrastructure has a relatively good core network. To support economic growth and social development goals, the task is to maintain and expand the country's electrical, water, transportation, and communications infrastructure. There is some worry that the state lacks the institutional or financial capacity to carry out the investment plans required to fund infrastructure at the scale required. The current level of investment is insufficient and maintenance programs are behind schedule. Given the government's financial constraints, some of these investments will require private support. 
Accra. Ghana's economy has been growing steadily for the past two decades, with gains in practically every sector. Growth in the economy has been accompanied by a decrease in poverty rates, which now stand at 24.3%, down 4.2 percentage points from the previous rate. Ghana Statistical Service, GSS, 2015. Despite these gains, the economy continues to be plagued by gaps in both economic and social infrastructure, which has slowed the rate of acceleration in the economy. Cost of Living Pretoria Pretoria has an average cost of living of $939, which places it in the top 39% of the world's least expensive cities, ranking 5,693rd out of 9, 1,294 in our worldwide ranking and 12 out of 36 in South Africa. The median after-tax salary is $1,633, which is enough to pay for 1.7 months' worth of living expenditures. In the list of finest places to live in the world, it is ranked 5,230th, TOP 56%, and the third best city in South Africa. Pretoria is the third largest city in South Africa, with a population of 742,000. Accra Accra's average cost of living is $772, placing it in the top 34% of the world's least expensive cities, ranking 6,116th out of 9,294 in our worldwide ranking and second out of 10 in Ghana. The median after-tax salary is $378 which is enough to pay for 0.5 months' worth of living expenditures. In the list of finest places to live in the world, it is ranked 5,391st, with Accra being the best city to live in Ghana. Accra is Ghana's second largest city, with a population of 2.29 million people. Tourism Pretoria Pretoria is a vision of purple because of the city's abundance of blossoming trees, which earned it the nickname Jacaranda City in South Africa. Given to the National Zoological Gardens of South Africa's animal magnetism, then get up close and personal with the cheetah research and breeding centra's big, scary kitties. Pretoria's buildings exhibit a wide range of architectural styles and influences, resulting in a distinctive urban landscape. Accra Ghana's most populous metropolis, which stretches along the Atlantic Ocean, is home to glistening beaches, historic buildings, museums, libraries, galleries, traditional markets, and a vibrant nightlife. Accra's architecture recalls the country's colonial past, with 17th-century fortresses coexisting with modern skyscrapers. The city's center business and shopping districts contrast strongly with the less affluent residential neighborhoods outside the metropolitan center, creating a genuine melting pot of cultures. In terms of demography, geography, infrastructure, cost of living, and tourism, this comparison of these two cities provides a comprehensive picture of how they each seem. We'll leave it up to you to decide which of the two cities is superior. If you enjoyed this video, please like, share, and subscribe to receive future updates from Africa Reloaded.